Next Wave DV's coverage of NAB 2011 is made possible by LCD Viewfinder, the essential accessory for DSLR video, CPM Film Tools, your lightweight solution for caging the beast, Manhattan LCD, the affordable solution for high definition monitoring, BNH, the professional source for photo, video, and pro audio. Tony here from Next Wave DV, and we're here with Joe from Sony. You guys are going to tell us about this whole new 4K adventure that you guys are trying out. Yep, uh, well, we're standing right here next to the F65, and this is our brand new top of the line flagship camera where what we have here is a numerically honest 4K camera. And what we mean by that is just like with how audio sampling works, human ear hears around 20 some odd hertz, but to, be, to get a good digital sample of, uh, so that we can satisfy that analog engine, you need to start out with about double the amount of data. So that's why your CDs, you start sampling at 44.1. Same principle basically is true here, and that's referred to as like Nyquist, where to make a 4K image, we actually need an 8K imager. So the last couple of years, as all these other fours have been coming to the market, we've just been slowly being trying to get 8,000, you know, some odd pixels into a Super 35 space. So we were able to do that, and now we have the F65. And this is an 8K imager sampling down to a, for a 4K final image. Uh, so 8K sample, 4K image. So. What kind of uh, availability is expected for this, and where would it fit in for price points? Uh, we're not releasing any of that information yet. It's actually still being decided. Um, release of this, you might begin to see them in the wild around late November, early December. Um, you know, they're, we're kind of ishing the time frame here. Um, right now, what we've done is we've shot a short piece with it just to kind of get an idea of the camera's capabilities. And we'll be going through a testing phase and just benchmarking the rest of its uh, capability. But so far, what we've found has been very, very encouraging. And then one of the other things we've actually, uh, another product that's come along to uh, you know, be in tandem with the F65 is now our SR memory uh, recording products. So we got a whole fleet of new things that we're bringing out to uh, both aid recording of 4K material on set and then the uh, working with 4K material in post. So it's a full 4K solution as, as Sony's tried to design it. So we have what's called the R4, which docks to the camera and that'll allow us to record um, uncompressed DPX, it'll allow us to record 16-bit uh, linear sensor data. We can do all the flavors of SR, 800 megabits, 440 megabits, and even our 220 megabyte codec that's brand new. And we're introducing that one as a kind of mezzanine codec where it'll be good for television production. And on our one terabyte cards, which uh, I think I have one on my pocket here. So this is, what, this is SR memory, this is what it looks like. That's a terabyte worth of storage. Um, so this has the equivalent of RAID 5 storage built into it, and it can transfer sustained at 5 gigabits per second. So what we've built in is just a high-speed 4K uh, data, uh, data management and movement system so that you can shoot fast, edit fast, and process fast. And we build all these different products in. So we have now, like the R4, which docks to the 4K, with our F35, we have the R3. So that'll dock and allow that camera then to go into the solid state world and you don't want to have to use tape. And then we also have, even for our F3 camera, which you know is a new child and you know a young one in the Cine Alta family, uh, we can even now take that camera, put an S-Log option in it, and then you can record uh, high bandwidth video, not 4K, but you know 440 megabits uh, off of a camera that is the child of an EX3. So this brand new memory uh, systems that we're coming out with is going to fundamentally change the Sony camera world in terms of uh, opening up your options if you want to really work at the uh, high end. You know, we're kind of figuring out now different high bandwidth workflows or low bandwidth workflows. So uh, there's some really cool stuff coming out soon from Sony from the acquisition side even through to post. So it's, you know, it's hard to get excited about post, so we're trying. <laughs> well, it's, it's, it's still very, very exciting just to see uh, where last year we were just hearing information about the F3K and now we have kind of every spectrum from all the way down from the NX cam straight up to your brand new 4K systems. Yeah, for per flight $5,000, Sony probably has a camera for you. I mean, you know, I, I, this is the principle of like statistics are on my side now. So <laughs> you just tell me what you need and I probably have a feature set that can get you close if not all the way there. Sounds good to me. Pleasure. Subscribe to us on YouTube and visit nextwavedv.com for more news and training for video and filmmakers.